Bill Alexander Show is brought to you by Alexander Art. Create beautiful oil paintings faster and easier than you ever thought possible, even if you've never picked up a paintbrush in your life. Alexander Art. You can paint, we promise. AlexanderArt.com. I have a farm scene, uh, scene in my mind, and obviously you have some songs, you know, and some ideas, and so the, the way the farm is going, and what is going on there, and, and what time of the year, and I thought I painted maybe in the autumn time, and the leaves on the road, and a happy little road going by, and a couple of farmhouses there, and, and uh, so, so in that direction. First, like I ever say to you, you have to have it ready in your mind. Then there's no problem to fire it right on that almighty canvas. I already started the magic bite. I went out to run the cameras, I thought, before they are ready, I'm already gone. And everyone said, okay, let's go, fire off. No mercy. See, there we are. Again, don't put too much magic right on. And I, I like to say it over and over because on all my classes, the main headache always was to wet. The brush is always too wet. To clean that brush is always a headache, especially for you girls. I love the girls, but the <laughs> problem is they should have more oomph on their hands to get rid of that paint dinner. That's why we invented that. You have to shake it up somewhere. And when you paint, you cannot just spend time to get that off. And so I have, that is in my technique is always, you knock it off, you are rough. And I know women can do it so good. So make sure you shake it off or knock it off. And, and this is the best way for me to get rid of that paint dinner by having a little post. See, and that, that's, that's quite dry. You couldn't do it with the, with the, with the rag. So, again, the happy blue. This time, the happy blue sky <clears throat> on the farm. On the farm, a happy blue sky. Maybe with bluer than blue. I got the blues, I got the blues. <clears throat> the against the blue, I want to pull it even down a bit more. Against the blue, the colors are sometimes nice, even if I lose a little bit of perspective. But in order to get perspective, I'll show you what I do. I will use my knife in this case, and I will cut in kind of a floating cloud there. Ah. Yeah, it doesn't matter, you know. Clouds, they come, you see them in all kinds of shapes and forms. Going off to yonder. Okay, leave it like that. It's still a nice cloud. And if you want, now clean your brush. Clean your almighty brush. Make sure you have a clean brush and you can just put a little bit of wind into that. Good, 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 good. But you see it's nice and dry. Now out of that we will fire in. We will, we will, we will fire in. Uh, Kind of a little mountain again. I put over here some white, some black, some passion blue, some alizarin crimson. They are the mountain colors actually. You can have it lighter, you can have it darker, you can have it more in gray, you can have it whatever you want. See, in this case, it's a bit too dark already. I will ask for a bit more red in there, alizarin crimson and a touch of white yeah, and mix it like marble. Yeah, can you see how I get together? Good. That's, I think that's what I want. Yeah, then you hang it on there. What type of a mountain can be a whole mountain? But I would like to show this. Oh, maybe a mountain is coming in from here. 
from here there. See? Something like that. Maybe you can go up here and let, let that side be the mountain side. And this is the farm side there. See? Pull it down and all the excitement, all the excitement with it. See, no. You say, where is the light coming from? Never forget, where is the light coming from? I would say, I will add a little touch of red into that. A little touch of red. Can you see what I do here? Can you see what I do here? A little touch of red. Red is sunshine, is love, is, is excitement, and it's, it's life. And uh, maybe we cut it in like this. See? And see the, see the details, the movements? That's the nice part. Because of that heavy paint, you have to use a, a solid, solid, strong paint. Look at that. Isn't that fantastic? Isn't that fantastic? Look at all those details with a couple of strokes. This is what makes it painting. No, no, we will, we will, we will. Maybe give this a little bit of a touch there. Put that to life. And now we will use white, touch of white, we put it over here, and a touch of blue, but boy, try a wee little, wee little, wee little, just nice. Maybe that's already a bit too, maybe not. I will try it first. Try it and then you see. Yeah, on the shadow side, beautiful. That little bit of blue does a low look, it does fantastic. See? Look at that. That's a nice happy mountain already. Now we will we will create a far away, far away, far away, please this. Far away, far away, far away, far away. Far away, far away, whatever is there, whatever is there, it's far away. A bit too close, I want to have it far away, far away. If it doesn't work like that, it will work like that. If it works like that, I use my little brush. And I use white, there's too much blue already. And see, I, I just want to shed it off like this far away movement. Far away movement. See, maybe a bit more light in there, more light in there. There's that little corner there. You can see there, that's good. Far away movement. And now you start firing in a dark first. Dark, I will clean my brush. And I will cut off my almighty paper, piper. So, and blue, and black, and, and I can use a bit of that paint here, that, that mountain paint, and sap green. See, and have it like, that's good. Bit of a distance now. There's a tree. See how nice it comes? Leave that little hole open. Open up that little hole there. 
because that gives you a kind of a extra far away whatever has happened there. See? Oh, go in there. See, now I have all the steps there, beautiful sky, nice blue, beautiful mountain line up there, and the far away distance, whatever it is, that is far away. And now you, you, you fire in, you fire in. I think what I have really I lose all of a sudden, I get that feeling, I got to have a big tree right here. A big, devil of a tree there. You will see, it will make that painting a bit more umpa. Hey, oh, that's that. See, you have that mountain there, and the power of a big tree in front here. And now we will squeeze a nice little farm in here, right in there. Right in there. The, the balance, it gives you a nice balance there. You know, there's a lot of, lot of tunes in your ear all of a sudden. You think about the farm, there's always a lot of happiness going on there, and sadness too. The farm is, uh, the farmer has to be very solid too. To go through, there's a lot of times there, cows die and their animals are not going right or whatever, whatever. But the, in general, it's always good food there and it's a lot of, lot of happy, happy things going on there. I use a bit of that blue with that red. Yeah, I try to tune down that red to kind of a uh, maybe that bit more white. Let's see what it is here. See, we, we will. Mm -hmm. See, we will create kind of a happy tree trunks. But what, what I do is just a, a sideways pull and a push up. See, and then you have it bigger on the bottom and smaller on top. See, like this here. And you don't have to have it always straight. You can set it up like this. Here's a big tree. See, make it a bit crooked, that's good. Could be this, that branch is broken long ago. The wind cut off that side. And that side growed up. It's up to you. You can make up your little stories about whatever was happened. Because the time, you are the artist, you are the creator, you are next to God, and you can create all those wonderful things. Light is coming from this side. Yeah, got a bit of highlights in here and there. See, beautiful scratches, what it does. See, scratches, wonderful. Don't worry, you can do all those things. All those things you can do. See? No, we will, we will, we will have, we will have, uh, what kind of a roof? Maybe 
a greenish, don't have to be always a, a red roof, a greenish roof here. Yellowish, greenish roof. See? Something in that direction. Go from there. Now we will, I will go into the magic white and make a dinner paint. And I create a white and red and Indian yellow. And I create a kind of a reddish uh, autumn colors. And then I will highlight some trees in that direction. Leave that side dark and have this side lighted up like that. See that little rust color or red, it does so much to you. Hey, maybe here, that tree, before I get that house gone, I would rather get the trees first. See? See what this, those colors can do for you? Red, Indian yellow, and white. And then you just hit the trees, you think they're very dark here. Maybe I like it a bit more sunny like this. And I always think the sun is coming from this side. That is the way to do it. See, it's a bush in front. And there's, I always hit it from the sunny side. Sunny side is number one there. See, no, we will, we will, we will. I go into magic white again. Watch what I do, magic white. Take a bit of the thicker white. It's always easy to make paint thinner, but it's hard to make it thick. See, when you need a thinner, no problem. Then I go into the magic white and that white alone. Or we have, you can buy other paint what is, uh, what's already thinner. See, look at that. Sometimes you see, when you see the brush, you see the dark on top. Can you see it here? See, then I use what I do. I don't want to lose all that inside paint. I just brush it off on, see what I do? I brush it off on the, can, on the paper here. And then I can use that paint in the inside again. I hate to lose that. See? You can only use it so long. Again, the thinner paint sticks on the thicker paint. I thin it down with magic white. And then we fire off. Oh, maybe here I will leave that dark. I have one. See, against that dark, you build it up the way you want. See, here you can have uh, uh, yellow, white. Indian yellow, white, and a touch of green. See, it makes it a lighter color, look like this. And then you can highlight this here a little bit. See? Oh, that's nice. That is nice. Maybe here you highlight a little bit on the sunny side. And then you got that tree right too. See, it all comes to life. <clears throat> here, maybe like like that. See, hit that brush like this. Light hits into the road like that. And on this side, you have a darker blue and yellow tones green, but I want to have a darker there. I use zap green and pression blue together, and I roll in the dark color there. See, 
dark on the side. Can you see how you lead it? The light, the light is coming this way, and you light up one side and the other side. I have to have more, more light power, more light power. <coughs> Uh, maybe here, white, go into the magic white, magic white, and whatever you got here, you see, and this, light it up, a touch of Indian yellow, now you got it really pitchy, nice, watch this, Do you even highlight this now, can you see, this is beautiful, highlight all the things he really wants to, wants to, Maybe here I would like to highlight a bit more. Let, let the sun be there. Maybe here I will fire in a little bit of light. See? <clears throat> you are the leader of light. Use it to your best. Use it the way you think it is your cup of tea. See, I do it my way and you got to do it your way. And sometimes it's the same like you put too much sugar in your coffee or you you put too much salt on your bacon and eggs, whatever. Um, there's a certain way, a certain, certain way that you like it, and a certain way you don't like. So you do it your way. The, I, I like it this way. Now you can say, I, don't, I wouldn't like to paint it that way, but do it your way. It got, life has to be your way, otherwise it never was good. <clears throat> it's nice when you come to the time you sit down and look back on your life and you say, it was my way. I did it my way. <clears throat> and that is a nice feeling. Here, I do it my way. Here, there are. There's a house here, standing there. Now we were, we were here in the cable end. See? And a bit higher here. See, there's this perspective, right? Always higher here, and that is when you see the gable end there. Yeah, 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 yeah. And now you can use the white with a touch of blue, what looks always good. And you can have... Hmm? I think the light's coming from there, draws a shadow underneath there, and uh, it will light up here again. You can light up here. So now we will we will put the door in there somewhere, and we we will put some windows in by using white and a touch of <coughs> Taylor green. That green is like a. It has a glass feeling. See, see what I do here? I just use a kind of a glass feeling there. You can cut it in half if you want. And you can still <coughs> give it a bit of a shine like this, and like this, and like this, and like this, <coughs> see, and then you, you, you put the happy chimney on there, on that house, there, see, that's good, and then you create a Couple other roofs there, could be a red roof. <coughs> uh, maybe we go from here to here. 
There's a house right behind here, a smaller one. Then you see this part of a roof there. Maybe we make it so that it has all kinds of colors there. Uh, it makes it more painting. See? And then you, you, that's the shadow side. It's the shadow side there. See? You create a little bit of dark in between there. See? <clears throat> and then you, 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 you highlight it like this. Yeah. See? And then you, you, <clears throat> you can have a little shed there, standing there. It's a wood shed, whatever it is. See? <clears throat> and it has a, Whatever it has a roof there, it goes flat in the back, and it has a door, a wide open door there. You see, you, you create it all, you think you're on a farm, you, you know what, what we need on the farm. <clears throat> Looking into that, you would have a little bit of a, you see, in that way, a little bit of that, that side here. You can have that, see. And then you, 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 you can have a, a, this is happy, happy little outhouse, that's good too. See? <clears throat> and then you, 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 you run a happy little road in there. See? A happy little road in there. And that is that almighty painting. So, how you liked it? You see? There we are. You enjoyed it? I thank you for watching me. Bye bye. Want more beautiful oil paintings? Bill's paint and all your art supply needs are only a click away at alexanderart.com. Just click on the online store link. You can paint, we promise, alexanderart.com.